first you'll need a container, small Kindreg or some kind of sweet, yes? Um, it doesn't matter if it has a hole on the top or not, because you can always make one. Right here I'm going to use a knife, and you stick the knife in, and you twist it around, like so, until you can fit your pinky finger in, like that, yeah? So now the hole is big enough. So uh, my container splits in half, so just to make sure that none of the materials fall out, I'm going to put some tape around just to make it extra safe. Make sure it's tight and that it won't come undone, if necessary. Okay? Go. Here we are using sodium chloride, uh, which is used for weed killer. Try and find weed killer which is primarily based by um, sodium chloride. Okay? Now, now open up the pot and you'll need some paper here. Fold it in two. Now we're just going to pour some on here and then pour it in make sure that you're doing this on a surface which you don't mind getting powder on then pour the sodium chloride into the container now you have to do this a couple of times, two or three depends on how big your container is okay now pour all the excess stuff into the pot take it a little bit out so then it's got a tiny bit of room for the fuse because the fuse is going to be quite fat as you can see from the hole Okay, now we're going to make the fuse. Now, you need masking tape. You don't really need a knife, but it helps. And the sodium chloride, yet again. Okay, so get two strips. And stick them together to make the um, fuse wider. Now, open up your sodium chloride and just dip it in everywhere and then just shake off the excess now that is part of our fuse then get your paper again and pour small bits of the sodium chloride into the paper and just go down the fuse with it Right, there we are. Now, just fold this sec the second bit over the first bit to hide over all the to go over all the potassium nitrate. Oh, uh, chloride. Get another piece of tape because sometimes it doesn't stick because there is lots of potassium chloride on it. So stick a third bit on and just pick it up and just tape it over it doesn't matter if it doesn't look good because we are going to fix that in seconds now get some more tape and just tape up all the bits that are showing and all of that so then none of it can come out This is how your flute fuse will look in the end. Okay, it's not fully complete, but it will be soon. Sometimes it's hard to light the um, tape because it's all wrapped up and it's all compressed. So just rip off a tiny bit, fold it in half, so then it's quite you know straight, loose, all of that. But leave a tiny bit of the stickiness, so then you can just stick it on the top, so then that will light the fuse. Now. You stick your fuse into the hole, put it in really deep, so then 
it, it, in case it doesn't work it will burn that and there you have it your own flare or roman candle but better than a roman candle It's not very important, is it? Yeah, it is. And it's dark. There's not really anything. Feel that heat! Guys, put it off the bin. You'll see the heat. No, I'll show it. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Oh. Uh, I'm, I'm no, no, leave it, leave it, man. Trust me, I'll move it. Move the bin, Nick. No, leave it. Ah. 